Hi, I'm Justin Slagle, CEO and co-founder of The Partner Masters. Today, I want to walk you through how to associate your certified engineers in Partner Center so you get full credit with your Microsoft partnership. Let's dive in. All right, so I'm going to take you into Partner Center. And within Partner Center, anybody who has an Azure Active Directory account will, should have access. So all they have to do is go to partner.microsoft.com or we've even made a short link, tpm.ms forward slash PC for Partner Center. When you go into Partner Center, they won't have a lot of access. So all, all they'll need to do is either click on my access or click on the settings gear. Either way, they'll get to the same spot. And within my access on the left-hand navigation, there will be a section right here that says my learning profile. When you click on my learning profile, they'll come up and ask, Hey, do you want to get learning a partner university access or do you want to associate your Microsoft learning account? Ideally, it's, it's best to, to do both. But the most important thing is to click associate my Microsoft learning account. And here it says, are you sure that you want to associate your Microsoft learning account? Remember, Microsoft learning accounts are personal. Associating uh, or having a certification or any type of exam, that's something that an individual owns. So typically, your Microsoft Learning account is, an, is a personal account, like a Live account, a Hotmail account, a Gmail account, and so forth. If a person goes from one Microsoft partner to another Microsoft partner, they own their certifications and they are allowed to take it from one to another. Even if your company sponsors that person, pays for them to take the exam, gives them time off, it's still the individual's certification. It's not the company certification. So as a Microsoft partner, we go through this process to associate our certified engineers to our partnership. And that's what we're doing here. So Microsoft is then saying to the individual, are you sure that you want to associate your learning account? Hey, you, can, you won't be able to change your association for at least 30 days, and your learning account can only be associated up to three times in a 12-month period. You click, yes, associate my account, and then it goes through and it will actually have you sign in to your uh, personal account. So that's the idea behind this. Now, once the person goes through this process, then all of the certifications will start showing up within Microsoft Partner Center in about two days. So then you'll be able to see, hey, have we achieved that modern work solution designation? Have we achieved that infrastructure solution designation? Or maybe you're going for an advanced specialization. In any case, you always want to make sure that you have your certified engineers associated to your Microsoft partnerships. If you guys have any questions, make sure to hit us in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We appreciate the views. Thank you so much.